Hi guys, welcome to Concept of Mathematics. I am Utpal Khan Singh. Today we will explore the effect of coefficients a, b and c in quadratic function. As we know, a quadratic equation in a standard form may have three coefficients a, b and c. To understand this, we will take general form of equation ax square plus bx plus c equals 0, where a, b, c belongs to set of real numbers. But one thing to note here, a must not be 0, because in that case our equation will convert into linear equation here we will take three quadratic equations and analyze effects of one coefficient keeping other two coefficient fixed first equation is x square plus bx plus 4 equals 0 in this equation we have kept b as a variable and others two as a constant. The next next equation is x square plus 3x plus c equals 0. It is very much clear that the letters in red colors have been kept as variable and others two constant have been kept as constant. Now we will explore the graphs of all these uh, equation to understand better. I have uh, made a graph here for x square plus bx plus 4 equals 0. Now in this equation we will uh, uh, take a range of b from minus 20 to 20 and uh, we will slide we have a slider here we will slide this from left to right and see what will happen to this graph ok I am moving this point towards right and keep observations on the vertex of the graph okay again I am moving towards left vertex is moving towards right correct it is following a inverted parabolic path the vertex is following inverted parabolic path okay this is because of we are changing b here okay the next equation is x square plus 3x plus c in this we have taken range of c again from negative 20 to positive 20 and see what happens to this equation and how does the graph moves in the Cartesian plane ok we'll move C our graph is going up while increasing C and coming down when we decrease C it is very clear that the effect of C on this graph is towards the vertical movement only now our next equation is ax square plus 2x plus 4 in this equation we have taken a range of a from negative 10 to positive 10 now once again we will move the slider towards left and right and see what happens to this graph 
I'm moving sliders towards the left okay and uh, to explore more I have expanded this uh, our E is in the negative region so the graph has bent towards down or other words it is opened downwards again I am moving A towards 0 and notice what happens when A becomes 0 we hope it, be, it should become uh, a straight line it is straightening now and ok it is approximately a straight line and it has been again crossed 0 and it is opened upward so the role of coefficient a is to uh, if a is positive the graph will be opened upward if a is 0 which we don't expect but if it is 0 it is a straight line and again uh, if the graph is open downwards then it has to cross a straight line feature and then bends downward so uh, I think it is uh, clear and again I uh, highly recommend you to uh, if you have any doubt about what I have covered so far on this topic don't hesitate to ask also if you like this please comment share like and most important if you uh, like this please subscribe thanks for watching